A sudden calm outside. For a moment, no soldiers. Just us alone with hundreds seeking refuge. Well, not quite alone. The Taliban are doing security. Every day, this place gets stranger and stranger. Amongst the crowd, British passport holders waving to us, unable to come forward, told to stay where they are. There are lots of British nationals and residents, and Europeans as well here, waiting for their turn inside. They've taken days to get to the gates. Many have the paperwork. They all say it's been absolutely horrendous and dangerous. I've been stuck here for the past two days. I'm yeah. trying to get in. I went to the Americans. They pushed me out. They kicked me out. I went to yeah. the Germans. They beat me out with the sticks. They fired us. You see, yes. these, you see these uh, gas fires that they make you cry? Yeah, tear gas. Yeah, tear gas. My mom is My kid, sick. He's like a one-year-old kid. They fired with the gas. And the, everyone was crying right here like an hour ago. The tear gas in between the kids. You see the kids here, they're like one year old kid. How can you put the Look, gas? They're the who, Americans. Is that the Americans? Yeah. 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 And they're too Look. rude. The Americans, the Germans, they're too rude. They beat up people with, with baseball bats. While the British soldiers are trying to deal with large numbers of UK nationals and people cleared to come to Britain, They've also taken in hundreds who should be at the American base, not here. Getting them to the right place is a logistical nightmare. Protecting them and the base from being overrun is hard. The Paris form into a defensive square, trying to keep the crowds calm, urging people to sit. All ages are here, all confused, tired, upset and desperate. For now, at least, the British relief effort has to pause to let the American relief effort continue. Well, the crowds have got so close now um, that the um, soldiers have to form basically a square um, to get from one compound uh, to another. They're taking out civilians and uh, they're trying to keep everyone calm. Those of them have got the right to come inside, but at the moment they can't. Very, very tense here, very, very tense, because these people are desperate. In single file, the evacuees heading to America are brought from one camp and directed to another. Whole families attempting to escape the new Taliban emirate of Afghanistan. There are always so many children, hopefully they're too young to know what on earth is going on. Children too amongst the crowds at the moment blocked from entry into the place that could be the gateway to a new life. Or if they're British, their rightful home. From the compound, a helicopter lifts off, ferrying the refugees to the military airport, their next step on the journey to freedom from the Taliban. <laughs>